Hi guys, it's Harry here with Laser Know How. Today we're going to take a quick look at the Hyper Series of laser. I've got the 22 watt here. We also do a 12 watt version and a 28 watt version. So real high powered lasers here. So for a quick look around the unit, obviously side on, you've got mounting bracket and clamp, and you've got the two safety chain locked there as well. So if we spin it right round, it's a heavy laser this one as well. So on the back, we've got power, power com connector and power switch, the fuse is on the back as well. Then we've also got safety key switch and interlock, ILDA in and out, and then we've also got power for each of the three diodes on here as well, so you can adjust how much power. The lasers are very well balanced, they've got a clear white to start with, but let's say you're using the 28 watt version indoors, you know you never want to take it above, say, 6 watt. Just dial down your power on each of the diodes an equal amount and you'll have a much lower power laser for indoor use. It's also got the invert X and Y switches on there which is really useful. If you're using two of these lasers and you don't want to have two ILDA cable runs to the stage, link them together, flip that X inversion over and they'll scan towards each other. Really useful to have that on the unit. You've also got a test mode. As standard, when you turn this laser on, it's not going to do anything without ILDA plugged in. Because it's such high power, that's just a safety feature of the unit. If you've plugged it in and you want to check, yep, everything's up and running, just flick that test mode on, it'll fire out and turn it off again. Then it's not going to do anything else until you plug that ILDA in. So if we spin it back round, you can see here we've got the laser aperture protector, two screws, down it comes, lock that back in place. We've got the mirrors and the scanners inside there. We do a 30k version of that and we do a 40k version of that. So let's say you were going to do something like the 28 watt 40k version. You would have a laser there that's absolutely incredible. Beams are going to be visible with very little haze and the graphics that you're going to produce for those 40k scanners are going to be crystal clear and there's going to be no scanning across that you can notice. So yeah, this is the hyper series from Laser Know How. Check it out at laserknowhow.co.uk.